as operator of one of the largest air cargo terminals in the world, we recognize that Hactel must take a leading role in sustainability. So we have integrated sustainability into our decision-making process, and I'm very proud to have a team of colleagues whose commitment supports us on our journey. Sustainable decisions are not always costly ones. They often make sound business sense too. We see sustainability as a key to our success, as well as contributing to the greater good of our environment and community. We have introduced many green initiatives over the years, transforming our equipment and facilities to become more eco-friendly. In the past decade, Hactol has successfully reduced the lighting power consumption by over 30% and consistently recycles over 90% of paper and plastic. In 2018, we took our commitment to the next level by launching a green terminal program. One of our more recent moves was the opening of a 1,600 square meter rooftop solar farm. We will continue to invest in measures that reduce our impact on this fragile planet. Hactel is an important partner of the Airport Authority in our carbon reduction and environmental management programs, winning the carbon reduction and the waste management awards in recent years. They have reduced their carbon emissions by over 30% in the last 10 years and are setting an excellent example for others to follow. I believe maintaining our strong partnership with Hactel is essential to realising our vision to becoming the world's greenest airport. We've undertaken many green projects over the years. We've upgraded our chiller rooms to cut energy use and utilise more eco-friendly refrigerant. Plastic reduction is a key aim. We are a no-straw partner of Ocean Park Conservation Fund and we gave eco bats, reusable food containers and water bottles to our 2,400 staff to reduce their consumption of single-use plastic products. And we've installed 100 water dispensers throughout Super Terminal 1 and stopped the sale of water in plastic bottles. Our annual Green Week, held since 2016, give green groups the chance to share sustainability messages with our staff and associates. We also engage with our community, joining in activities such as the Tree Planting Challenge and collaborating with an NGO on a sustainable tree project. Hector first joined our Climate Change Business Forum Advisory Group in 2012 and is an active member of BEC. In 2020, they also became a signatory to our Low Carbon Charter and we are also delighted to co-organize the Green Week since 2019, which provides an ideal and highly effective showcase to promote our mutual goals. Hector clearly cares about the environment and is an inspiration to the business community in Hong Kong. Achieving sustainability in Hato, we need many key elements, especially the passion of our green team and also the keen support of all Hato staff. The team spirit in one hard manner drives the strong collaboration to make impossible possible. Such Hato green spirit motivates us to create synergy with many external partners in multi-dimensional ways, including authority, eco-industry, airport community and NGO. We were pleased to facilitate Hacto's Sustainable Tree project in 2019, collaborating in this challenging project to transplant trees from the terminal rooftop, give them new lives to nearby schools. Though sadly we were unable to save them all, they were converted to mulch and wood chips for mushroom cultivation. This year, we are proud to collaborate with Hacto in the Organic Farm project and I look forward to working with the enthusiastic and ramen-loving team once again.